Volunteers helping residents as best they can during this fire, offering food and water and shelter. But returning residents need help with the cleanup when they get back. 7 News photojournalist Major King live in Larimer County. And Major crews are putting together recovery kits. That's right, Mike. Uh, this is all part of the Disaster Assistance Center put together by the county at CSU. As part of that, the Red Cross made available today disaster cleanup recovery kits for those who have lost their homes. These include shovels for digging, rakes for gleaning anything of value, and check out these sifting devices for looking for the smaller valuables. Also, a bucket with a mask, trash bags, a cleansing solution, and water bottles. It's all meant to help bring back a sense of community, even for those whose homes were not lost. And the houses that are standing, um, it's hitting those people just as hard because their neighbors' homes are not there. And so I think that sense of community is real important. How do we help them maintain their sense of community through outreach, through information? Those disaster kits paid for in part by the $20,000 raised by the Colorado Eagles in conjunction with Big Country over the weekend. So many other people have done the same thing uh, that I can't even mention them all, but thanks to all of them. Uh, a team of volunteers has been working up here in Fort Collins. And also I want to mention, lastly, the signs along Overland Trail. I don't have a shot to show you, but there are so many you can't count them thanking the firefighters for all the hard work that they're doing. And believe me, as hot as it is out here, that is very hard work that they're doing up there. A better day today, in spite of the 189 homes total lost in this fire. Reporting live at CSU Foothills Campus, Major King, 7 News. All right, Major, thank you. Volunteers also helping evacuees get clean clothes at the ranch in Loveland. Southern Baptist Disaster Relief has set up a laundry trailer. Evacuees can drop off their dirty clothes, and volunteers will see to it that they're washed and returned all folded up. And thanks to many of you, our partners, the Colorado Eagles and Clear Channel collected money. Now the Red Cross is getting $20,000 for fire relief. The Eagles kicking off that fundraiser last Thursday. You heard Major talk about it. They had an initial pledge of $5,000, then matching it after people and businesses in northern Colorado pitched in another 9000 in just four hours.